Okay, first I just want to talk about the two SCOTUS opinions recently. The New York concealed carry case that uh, Clarence Thomas wrote the majority opinion on. I just want to say black judges matter. <laughs> the second one, Roe v. Wade. They overturned Roe v. Wade. I checked it out this morning. The organizers say unvaccinated people are not allowed to go to the My Body, My Choice demonstration. Whoa! All right, but what I actually want to talk about is the Pledge of Allegiance. I don't say it, and I want to explain why. The reason I don't say it is the whole frickin' thing is bullshit. <laughs> I'd be lying if I said any of it. It's all wrong. Uh, it started in 1892, this guy Francis Bellamy. He was a socialist. Like, I'm not a socialist. I can't say that. He was trying to push kids into socialism. They used to salute like this. <laughs> they did that for 50 years. You know what that looks like? 1942, they changed it. It didn't really look all that good in 1942 to make <laughs> all the kids do that salute. Anyway, I'm going to go through it. Here's why I don't say it. I pledge allegiance to the flag. It's a piece of cloth. How can you pledge allegiance to a piece of cloth? Like, I ain't doing that of the United States of America. That phrase don't even matter, it's, the, it's a clause, so who cares what that part is. And to the republic for which it stands, now you could argue in 1776, the 13 star version was a republic, sure. But the 50 star one, if you think that stands for republic, you ain't paying any attention to what's going on. One nation, we're not one nation, do I look like a part of the Cherokee nation? We're like hundreds of nations here. Under God, no, it doesn't go God, then the federal government, then the state government, then the people. It's the other way around. We tell God what to do. Uh, and plus, I'm an atheist, so I can't say that. Indivisible. If you saw my Liberty 101 talk on secession, you know what I think about indivisible. All empires eventually break up. The bigger they are, the harder they fall. This one's going to end. Liberty and justice for all. That's a great goal, but how do you pledge to that? Sure. So anyway, I don't say it, and I don't take my hat off when other people say it. Anybody that knows me, I don't take my hat off for very many reasons, and conservatives hate 